Armor Glaze. Following the do-it-yourself tutorial, we'll guide you step-by-step -step on how to give a new life to your shower base. Before you start, set the room temperature to 72 to 78 degrees Fahrenheit, 24 hours prior to the procedure. To get started, we will need a utility knife and razor blade scraper to remove sealant between tiles and shower base. Now take sandpaper grit 220 to remove remaining silicone. Remove drain piece and plug it in with a piece of cloth so the waste won't get in. Clear the area for the next step. In this step, we'll use sandpaper grit 220, a sponge, a bucket of water, and Ajax. Do not use shower head, just a bucket with water. Apply pressure when scrubbing to clean all stains and dirt. Some spots are harder to get dirt out from, so use a heavy duty brush. Rinse thoroughly and wash it again using sponge. Now we prepared a shower base for drying process. We will need hair dryer, isopropyl, and paper towel. Wipe it dry with paper towel and use hair dryer to get moisture out of hard to reach spots. Refer to a video. Take a paper towel and fold it a few times. Stick the tape to it and attach the shower head to prevent any water leaks during the process. Use the same tape to cover the drain pipe. Make two layers of tape, use small blade to cut a round hole. In this step, we will use paper towel and isopropyl to remove grease. Use the comb provided in the toolkit and wrap it with tape so to expose three millimeters of teeth. Mix the two parts together and stir for about seven minutes. For a better blend, stir along the walls and the bottom of a bucket. Wipe the bottom of the bucket before placing it in the shower. Use a heat gun to rid of bubbles on the paint surface. Pour the paint into the cup. Now when pouring the paint from the cup, slide it along the shower base slowly. In some parts you will notice gaps. Use a yellow plastic spatula to bring the paint up. Pour out the rest of the paint evenly around the shower base. Use the comb to spread it around. The paint will be collecting on top of the tape. Remove excess every 10 to 15 minutes. Watch closely for bubbles that appear. Use heat gun to eliminate them. In case some small particles did get in, use a small blade to remove it. Collecting the paint from the drain requires repetitive action. After removing it, come back within 10 to 15 minutes to collect again until it finally dries out and stops flowing. Once paint has stopped flowing, remove the tape over the drain by poking it. Gently take it out. Allow 24 to 36 hours for the paint to dry completely, depending on room temperature, which should be about 72 to 78 degrees Fahrenheit. Armor Glaze. Enjoy the new look of your shower.